Hi everyone. Today we are going to discuss about automation in a web control room register clients available clients and license management when we talk about automation in a web web control room it's all about it contains dashboard audit trail user management client management and many things here in con- control room dashboard when you see the dashboard you can see register clients available clients options see what are the register clients represents on control room dashboard so registered client is thing i have four available clients or else i have four thing very simple i have four developer license so i have uh, for example for if i have four or three licenses i have uh, three available clients in control room suppose but see here you can see i have only one registered client but my available clients are two i can consume up to two as of now i'm connected only one client so th- that is the one registered client the registered client is it's all about how many client i can connect or i i was registered through the control room so once i registered through the control room so maybe my client has been offline or online or disconnected whatever the status it is it must to be show in the registered clients so the answer would be you can change the answer register total number of registered clients in control room it is not at all about total number of clients total number of change it total number of registered clients in control room that is the exact answer for this question total number of registered clients in control room so if you are not registered in control room your client is still you can't connect if you if if you want to register your client in control room so that time you got first thing is you have to make sure you are user details has to be enabled or not so if your users are um, based on user details user in user in dashboard we have user management one option is there you have to go and register your user then you can make sure your client is working or not see here you can see my control room is only one client is registered that client uh, id and the description and uh, where the client is running and the application path so all the details so here my client is bot creator it is not bot executor so i am creating only one client 
I'm registering only one client that is bot creator. So that is the reason it's showing that my registered clients are only one. So this is the way I can uh, suppose I have five or six developer licenses. Based on that, I can register my clients. See in automation and control room where we can see the license details. So it means when uh, how many developer licenses. Uh, how many uh, metabot license or iq bot license or else uh, your developer bot runner license so everything you can see in in control room settings license management under the license management so license management it is it's all about uh, the many things uh, involved when the license will be expired or when the license will license would be available date so everything it will be uh, correlated in license management thank you guys thanks for watching this uh, we can see we can meet some other sessions thank you so much hi everyone Today, we are going to discuss about automation anywhere, web control room, register, clients, available clients, and license management. When we talk about automation anywhere web control room, it's all about it contains dashboard, audit trail, user management, client management, and many things here. In con control room dashboard, when you see the dashboard, you can see register clients, available clients, options. See what are the register clients represent on control room dashboard. So registered client is thing I have four available clients or else I have four thing very simple I have four developer license so I have uh, for example four if I have four or three licenses I have uh, three available clients in control room suppose 